All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Mob Psycho season three, episode nine. Uh, last episode was kind of crazy. It was very sweet. Obviously, the friend group, uh, you know, doing this fun, completely normal friend activity together. Uh, turning out they actually did find aliens. Aliens were super chill. They had a fun time. Ended up kidnapping one of the friends, but he, you know, he came back. He got brought back. Memories a little fuzzy, but that's fine. Nothing, not, nothing bad happened. Uh, and now we are on to the final arc of Mob Psycho, I believe, which, um, oh god, it sucks to think about that now that I'm thinking about it, but it's, I'm very excited to see what happens here, and I'm very much looking forward to, oh god, I don't even know, I literally don't even know, but I'm very looking forward to it, so as always guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well, it really means a lot for me, and let's go into this episode right now. We've literally never seen her talk about Mob's powers in kind of in present day, apart from that time when we saw her see his powers. It's crazy. They were such close friends when they were kids as well. Maybe. Did I already know about this? Did we see this in the trailer for this season, I think? I swear I know about this somehow. Oh shit. Mob relationship arc. <laughs> this dude fucking just came back from an alien planet. Oh my god, is everybody thinking about it? Jeez. She's gonna get like a million fucking people asking her out, dude. Do these guys even have any relationship experience? White tea poison's made of. Let's go. What does that mean? What does that mean? You know, forgetting a girl, bro. Huh? Huh? Oh, that was quick. He looks like a normal middle schooler, but yeah, I'm sure he's toned up in some way. I'm proud of him too. I'm proud of you, Mob. He gave him, he gave him a confidence boost. That's nice. Fight on! Fight on! Fight on! Oh, I didn't even know these guys were here. <laughs> yeah, these three definitely don't have any advice. One of them is a girl, so maybe. This guy, yeah, we need your help. Bro, you're gonna have so, many, so much competition, bro. Y'all need to have some confidence in him. At least enough confidence for him to actually do it. What would he change his hairstyle to, though? Huh? This is what we need. We need confidence from friends. I love you. She probably has to do this like 20 times a day. She probably doesn't even know you. Dude. Fuck off, man. Just be like... A line of people that she knows, and a line of people she doesn't. The other line can go away. I'm as curious as what she'll say to Mob. I feel like she'll probably reject him, but it'll be definitely a bit definitely be different to what she's doing to the other people. Yeah, he's just giving up that easily. <laughs> His face. <laughs> An assembly line. That's funny. I don't think she'd do that to Mob. Mob is a gentleman. He's got that down. He does that as well. He is very considerate. Absolutely. Absolutely. Mob is all those things. He, he hits all the boxes. That's facts. Yeah, they literally don't even know her. Whereas Mob knows her. I can imagine. She's probably been glorified her whole life. Like, she just has no interest in other people. Maybe Mob wasn't paying enough attention. Good question. He needs to understand that too. 
<laughs> Men are simple creatures. Uh, it's deeper than that. It's definitely deeper than that. The mob, but I get what he's saying. He's never liked someone? Damn. That's good advice. Mm hmm. That's what you were trying to say, Reagan? Yeah, you buffoon. Aw. They're good teachers to him. What the dog doing? I mean, if, if you get rejected, you just gotta be able to handle it. It's a learning experience, Mob. Setting the mood to- Oh my god, he's reading this online. <laughs> I mean, most of that was good advice, though. Just do it. Just do it, Mob. This is going to be so sweet. I hope if she rejects him, it's nice. Nicely done. He seems popular with the older ladies. <laughs> yes. You want best. what's best for Mob. That's good. I love that everybody has faith in him. And they're, you know, giving him com confidence. Oh my god, look at these hairstyles. <laughs> Oh, he could probably give good advice. Why is she transferring now, anyway? Isn't it a bit of a weird time to transfer? Yeah, exactly. You're just shooting your shot. You know how to make rice balls. I mean, that be, might be nice, too. Flowers? Yeah, absolutely. Flowers would be a good idea. Yeah, you picked out his clothes last time. No thanks. I love these two and their brotherly relationship. It's so nice. Oh, she did. She did come to uh, the office one time, didn't she? I forgot about that. I mean, I'd be very surprised if she said yes. I'm expecting a rejection, just for how it's kind of potentially playing out. But I at least want it to be a nice rejection. Yeah, get, get your calcium in, boy. <laughs> the fucking Saitama wallpaper. I love that. Oh, you calling her on the phone? Okay. Oh, you calling her mom? Ah, it's a home phone. Okay. Why are you calling in the kitchen, bro? Go somewhere private. Is he going to do this over the phone or in person? Yeah, okay. It's not that shaky. I'm so proud of him. He's doing great. I mean, she has to know what he wants. Considering what everybody else has been asking her. I don't like how... His emotional meter is increasing. I feel like it's just going to completely go to 100 straight away. If he gets rejected or if he gets accepted, I don't know what's going to happen, man. Oh, is he buying some flowers? Aww. Oh, it's the plant psychic guy. Oh, is he going to give him some flowers? I mean, that might be overkill. I don't know. Ah, oh, sweet of him, though. That's nice. Yeah, kids playing on his DS. Headphones in, waiting to cross a road. And a cat and a mouse? Oh, my God. Good job, Mom. Dude. Dude. Is this kid going to get fucking isekai'd? Nah. Tell me Mob saves him. Oh shit, he didn't even have time to use his powers. Oh no. Fucking kid, man. Shit, is Mob okay? Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Dude. God damn, dude. 
He probably didn't have time to even shield himself or anything. Shit. Right, so that was Mob Psycho Season 3 Episode 9. Uh, I was really not expecting that. God, freaking Mob just constantly saving people. Clearly then he didn't have time to actually use his powers. Meaning, I, I just thought Mob kind of permanently had kind of a barrier around himself that made it so he, you know, he can't get hurt from people. Um, or anything that may happen suddenly, but I guess not. I mean, we did see in the scene where he was with the Body Improvement Club, where, when he was getting the slaps on him, he did say, ow. So clearly that did kind of hurt him in some way. I guess that explains how now he didn't have enough time to kind of guard himself or put up a shield or anything like that. Um, so, shit, I, I really hope he's okay, but bleeding from the head is never, never good. But yeah, overall, very good episode. Definitely looking forward to the next. I'm not sure actually as to how many episodes this season has. It doesn't, I don't think it says anywhere online. It, it may be kind of 11 or 12, um, which in, in which case there's not many episodes left, but I'm looking forward to it um, next. Uh, well, looking forward to the next steps anyway. Yeah, anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.